The 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 Tell All Part 1 was nothing to write home about. But the cast members did raise eyebrows off-camera due to the news about them. Jibri Bell was the star attraction at the reunion, owing to his messy jabs at Ariella Weinberg. Jibri accused fashion disaster Ariella of being the most jealous person on the show, and claimed that her fake relationship with Biniam Shepra would never last because of the way that she holds her partner back. Jibri even challenged MMA fighter Biniam to a fight. But when Patrick Mendes' brother John showed up on set, Jibri eventually lost his sparkle. And that really amused fans. Pillow Talk stars Tim Malcolm and Kenneth Niedermeyer joined the show to give their commentary from behind the scenes. Fans welcomed this new tell-all format with open arms and enjoyed Tim and Kenny's chemistry. Patrick was exposed by Thais Ramon for cheating on her with another woman while they were in a relationship. However, former weightlifter Patrick didn't acknowledge his mistake, but did say that Thais is now expecting. Carrot Base who's also going to be a mother, and her husband Guillermo Royer were confronted by her ex-boyfriend from high school, who's oddly still bothered by her cheating on him. In the coming week, 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 will breathe its last, and 90 Day Fiancé, happily ever after, will take its place on August 28th. In Part 2, more fireworks are expected to fly between Jibri and the rest of the cast, amid Shayada Sween accusing Bilal Hazis of not getting her pregnant ahead of their Hia debut in Season 7. Fans aren't particularly thrilled about the upcoming spin-off either, owing to the likes of controversial Angela Deem and Big Ed Brown being on the cast member list. While the 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 was boring from the start, the cast somehow manages to spice things up with their antics. Makeup artist Mion Mona's skills failed to impress the 90 Day Fiancé fans who watched her on the tell-all. Shortly after the reunion episode aired, a screenshot of Miona in a purple outfit was posted on the internet. Instagram user 90 Day Fiancé or Savage claimed that the kind of makeup that Miona does only looks good when there's a filter used with it. In the comments, fans pointed out that for a professional, Miona's makeup was terrible. Someone else referred to her as a whole new level of clown. Questions have also been raised about Miona's age, as fans suspect that she is older than 23. Meanwhile, Mohammed Abdelhamid's alleged texts with a mystery woman and the drama caused because of the leaked screenshots on Instagram haven't affected his relationship with Eve Arellano. Fans wanted Eve to leave Mohammed after he made his intentions about wanting a green card clear on 90 Day Fiancé. However, after these supposed chats between Mohammed and his apparent girlfriend, fans are worried about Eve and her son, Theron. Meanwhile, Eve and Mohammed have both been sharing happy relationship updates on Ig. Recently, their stories were about their their trip to New York in June, in which the couple looked very romantic. Since the updates are older than the alleged texts, fans are wondering if there's something even Mohammed aren't telling them yet. In a 90 Day Fiancé first, two couples on a season ended up being pregnant before the show could even finish. Kara and Thais announced that they are pregnant during the Tell All Part 1. Interestingly, both were 16 weeks into their pregnancies. Kara and Guillermo used Instagram to share a compilation video of their cute pregnancy photo shoot with fans. Kara and Guillermo want to keep the gender of their baby a surprise, but did reveal that baby Royer is due in late November of this year. Meanwhile, despite Patrick's infertility issues, Thais, who's also pregnant, will deliver in November. She is having a baby girl with a former weightlifter. Source, at 90 Day Fiancé Zo Savage Instagram.